Sure. Thank you. Okay, thank you. Uh, thank you, Zia. And uh, by the way, who is at TCF Canada? Can you say who's who's representing TCF Canada? Besides uh, Zainab, of course. Because last weekend, man, I was in Calgary, so I don't know who that person is. It says TCF Canada. Uh, it might be um, Sajid Bai or it might be Samara. Okay. Oh, okay. Oh, <laughs> anyway, so I'll keep this short. Uh, again, Zia and everyone and the USA team, thank you for organizing this and thank you all for attending. For those of you who don't know me, I am, my name is Arif Bakur, and uh, I guess I'm the chair of the board of TCF USA, and I've uh, been associated with the organization for the last half year, Art Sarpan So uh, again, uh, just a couple of points, which I just wanted to make sure that we get across. Okay, Ramzan is the time when, at least in the USA, and I don't know worldwide with this me, but I know we're almost a third of our income comes from uh, during the Ramzan period, about 36% to be exact. So this is a very important point, uh, period. And also the fact that every year, Alhamdulillah, we have been growing in our Ramzan revenue by about 20% a year. So each year we go up and, and so on. Or or Issa Tohaskar, Issa Tohaskar, I'm Okay, we started early on, and by the way, the person who leads the uh, leads the effort is actually Salman, uh, and, and Salman Hassan, I don't see him, there he is at the top left on my screen, and oh, Salman is the chief executive. So the, the plan right now is that uh, it has been launched with a variety of efforts which are going on, and you must have started receiving your mail campaign and so on. But this year, unlike last two years, and like I said, in the last two years, we did not have events. In spite of that, we're growing at about 20%. This year in Shemashallah, there are almost like eight chapters who have already committed to having events. And if they are doing it, they are doing it, they are doing it, and it will so if any other chapter wants to have an, an iftar event, please contact uh, the, the chapter support team, Sahar Sumru and the rest. And uh, besides that, we, are, we have uh, they've launched a very effective, normally, uh, a social media campaign. Or social media campaign, I'm going to say those, the New Jersey stands out as one of the chapters who does this really well. Uh, in, in, in WhatsApp, promoting TCF on WhatsApp group. They I call, they collect, you know, tens of thousands of dollars just by using WhatsApp. It's effective way. So if you need to know more about how they do it, please contact Mona from uh, New Jersey, and I'm sure Sahar or Pakia will, will, uh, will get provided the contacts. The second, the kind of best in class sort of thing, or most effective so far, what we have seen amongst the chapters is, is Dallas. Is Dallas, as far as interaction with masjids you know and in houston also we've been trying to get into to interact with masjids but we've been less than successful so again we need to learn a lot from each other and if you need any questions any 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 help please 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 uh, you know contact uh, salman sahar and uh, the other right people to and again once again thank you so much ramzan is a difficult time for all of us as far as uh, other other activities are concerned but uh, really, we need your help at this time because chapters have a revenue, how many donations, or you are the core face, you are the people who engage with the donors. With that, I thank you everyone for the opportunity to speak a few words. And inshallah, uh, we'll continue the journey. Rabzan Mubarak, everyone. Asalaamu Alaikum. Thank you, Rabzan yeah. Mubarak. Um, let me let me now call upon uh, Asa Saab uh, to to share a few words on on TCL where it, where we are right now. It's been a while since we connected. A lot has been happening, and uh, I'm gonna start a few slides going so that Asa Saab can also talk through um, some of these numbers. But uh, just starting with this beautiful image, I'll talk a little bit more about it in a minute. Um, but, uh, go ahead. This is yours. 
एवरीवन बहुत ही अच्छा लग रहा है सब लोगों को देख के मैं अब बड़ी बेचैनी से इंतजार कर रहा हूँ जब इनशाला तला हम लोग मई में फेस टू फेस बनेंगे और उनसे फरहान भाई से बात हुई थी तो वो कहने लगे कि मे बी ये यू सी सी को एन ए सी सी कहना शुरू कर देना चाहिए <laughs> तो हो सकता है कि अभी वो मदीना मुनवरा में ये दुआएं मांग रहे हो <laughs> so, uh, हमारा पिछले uh, दो एक साल बड़े लाइक एवरी वन आई थिंक वेरी वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग एंड वेरी डिफरेंट इयर्स सबसे पहले समथिंग दैट आई 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 आल्सो वुड 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 रियली लाइक टू थैंक टीसीएफ टीसीएफ कनाडा के के कोविड दौर में जिस तरीके से थिंक बोथ टीसीएफ यूएस एंड टीसीएफ कनाडा हैव गैल्वनाइज्ड देमसेल्व्स और माशाल्लाह जो फंड रेजिंग का जो बिकॉज वी वर रियली टू बी ऑनेस्ट वी वी स्केट के फंड रेजिंग के हमारे नंबर्स पूरे होंगे कि नहीं होंगे बट अलहमद ना सिर्फ नंबर्स पूरे हुए लेकिन उन्होंने हमें ये भी हिम्मत दी कि अभी आप जो देख रहे हैं कि 1833 स्कूल यूनिट्स के साथ हम ये नया वाला साल स्टार्ट करें और ये हम 100 से ज्यादा आई थिंक ज्यादा नंबर इज अबाउट 120 एंड और समथिंग जो नए यूनिट्स हम ऐड कर रहे हैं इस साल सो so इन In all, I think we are adding about 120 units or so. Just me say, I've been 90 to carry. Number is more than 140 this time. 140. 140. Oh, okay. <laughs> I've lost count. Uh, and I'll just, in, you know, context provide. करने के लिए मैं ये कह दूँ इस जब may or may not like it. अगर मैं इसको पेंशन करूँ कि इस वक्त हम तकरीबन almost 900 afternoon shift start कर रहे हैं. Uh, and uh, a few years back hum log ye discuss kar rahe the zia had come up with a proposal ke 12 afternoon shift start karni hai unne kaha ki nahi yaar bahut zyada panch karenge panch se zyada nahi karenge so uh, i think we really come along way alhamdulillah alhamdulillah and uh, all thanks to all our supporters uh, everyone jinme se bahut sare log aap uh, yahan shamil hain by the way athar mahin mein dekh raha hu aap log bhi hain inshallah i'll be coming over to austin so i'll be seeing you uh, before uh, we meet in houston um so mashallah 1833 school units honge uh, 280000 bacche honge is saal um 13000 teachers and principals uh, jinme se mashallah 1500 ke kareeb hamari apni bachiyan hain jo padha rahi hain is waqt tcf mein um us din meri kisi sahab se baat ho rahi thi and uh, we are probably the biggest employer of women a private employer of women in pakistan and also probably we could be the biggest private employer in pakistan also uh, but you know tcf mashallah just like say grow kar raha hai it's it's really unbelievable and thanks to every one of you for contributing to the growth and for really making it happen um bahut sari cheeze tcf mein aur bhi ho rahi hain aapko uh, early year redesign ka hamara program hai jo ke स्टार्ट तो हमने पाँच छः साल पहले एक पायलट के साथ किया था अब वो आधे पाकिस्तान में फैल चुका है इंशाल्लाह अगले साल वो पूरे पाकिस्तान में ये प्रोग्राम जो है वो हम फैला देंगे और इसकी डिटेल्स कुछ ना कुछ तो खैर आपको शायद पहले भी आपसे शेयर होती रही हैं बट इन शह मे में रियाज एंड जिया गंड विद तो वो तफसील से और भी डिटेल्स बताएंगे लेकिन वी कम्प्लीटली रिवैम्प्ड अर्लियर स्कूलिंग और माशाल्लाह उसके नतीजे में बच्चों की लर्निंग बहुत इम्प्रूव हो रही है और दे आर एंजॉइंग देमसेल्व्स एंड इट्स अ कम्प्लीटली डिफरेंट क्लास एनवायरनमेंट एंड हैज बीन अ हैज बीन अ रिजाउंडिंग सक्सेस अनदर प्रोग्राम दैट वी रिसेंटली लॉन्च्ड डिजिटल लर्निंग प्रोग्राम वो भी हमारा जो है इनशाला उसको हम एक्सपैंड कर रहे हैं अगले साल वी हैड बिन been quite careful about repair and maintenance for the last few years is sir humne jo bhi hamare gaps the so there has been a massive uh, r&m program jo tcf is sir conduct kar rahi hai um, alumni development mein bahut sari nayi cheeze ho rahi hain the details we'll we'll share later but i can assure you that as always tcf mein kuch na kuch ho raha hota hai ek dafa main balki chand din pehle ek school gaya tha तो एक टीचर बहुत ही बेचारी परेशानी से कह रही थी कि सर ये सब कुछ सोचता कौन है 
इतनी सारी नई चीजें टीसीएफ में हो रही होती है अब जाहिर है कि इसके कल्परेट कुछ जया है कुछ रियाज है मेरा तो कोई ज्यादा रोल होता नहीं है लेकिन माशाल्लाह I'll stop sharing because because everyone's faces are much nicer to see than our than our few slides. But um, yeah, I think this is this has been a a time of sort of reconsolidation consolidation and rebuilding and sort of reimagining some of the way the program works. Uh, all of it has been fueled by the efforts of people on this call and many more. Uh, I'd like to just invite Asan Saab to to share how he sees the last few years, um, especially the the effort in the in North America. Yes, Asan Saab. एक्चुअली असलम एवरीबडी हुआ ये था कि एज सून एज कोविड स्ट्रक वी हैड एन अर्जेंट मीटिंग हेयर एंड वी ऑल्सो वेंट इन टू अ डिफेंसिव मोड फॉर अलर वाइल टू सी दैट हाउ इट विल इम्पैक्ट द फंडिंग एज वेल एज द लर्निंग क्यों स्कूल बंद हो गए थे और सब कुछ हो गया था तो मैं ये समझता हूँ कि इट इज़ अ ट्रिब्यूट टू दिस वंडरफुल ऑर्गेनाइजेशन व्हिच हैज सो मेनी वॉल्टियर्स टू ऑल चिप इन एंड यू नो एज वी बीन सेइंग ऑलवेज दैट कम्युनिटीज थ्राइव व्हेन एवरीबॉडी चिप्स इन एंड ऑल ऑफ यू हैव एक्चुअली प्रूव दैट स्पेशली नॉर्थ अमेरिका में यूएस आउटसाइड ऑफ पाकिस्तान इज the largest contributor to fundraising and thank you very much everybody who has actually made that happen also canada um, has raised uh, 3 million dollars us 19 million dollars or ye 19 million dollars mein se taqriban 8 uh, 8 ya 9 million dollars zakat contribution mein hai that is why it is important that we are having this conversation right now because ramzan is around the corner and uh, as rf also said that bulk of giving comes at this time because people um, are very very generous especially um, when ramzan comes in um, basically uh, i think we also appreciate that various chapters found innovative ways of uh, tackling the fundraising effort because in person meetings nahi ho sakti thi like houston had a drive in cinema and um, you know canada mein online learning challenge tha kuch aur aur bahut sari aisi scheme shuru ki thi so um, i would say that uh, we at tcf uh, pakistan wish to actually pay a tribute to all of you for making all this happen thank you thank you asan saab thanks a lot um i remember those meetings in, in the in the early days of of and and i mean the 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 scenarios that were playing out in our heads and uh, the comfort with which today we are growing like as asan saab said uh it's it's so much changes when um you know the community that you're part of supports you and nilo for aunty would you like to say a few words now about how you see these two years and and uh, the future as well assalam alaikum everybody on the lighter side when i first met asad he had black hair like zias and he looked young and fresh today i'm looking at him and i wonder what happened he's gone white <laughs> totally we made him walk too much this year happened <laughs> <laughs> that's what i think asad <laughs> anyway uh, you know without the international chapters and all the all the chapters of um, tcf we would be nowhere covid was very very tough and we really had a tough time thinking initially thinking that we are going to lose it we are not going to be able to even sustain ourselves but 
Allah ke karam se and the hard work led by Asad, Zia, Riyaz, all of them, we managed not only to come out better than what we were before, and we managed to pay all the salaries, which is something that was so great to be able to pay the salaries of people who were jobless. So that, that was an exceptional thing. We had, STCF itself had a hard time, but we used the most easy method, sitting at home and sending WhatsApp messages. And I tell you, they work. WhatsApp, compassionate messages with a lot of pleading and love, they really work. And that's what we've been doing since then. We've decided to do, we tried to do an event or two, but it just, COVID didn't let us do it. So we did manage and we managed to meet our targets. Zia bullies us and gives us very high targets, even in COVID, but we do manage to meet them by the grace of God and because of the good name of TCF. So I just want to thank everybody for being a part of this journey and especially want to thank Asra's gray hair and thank you. <laughs> Thank you, Neelofa Aunty. Anybody who knows Neelofa Aunty and myself knows ki kaun kisko target de raha hota <laughs> and, and I suddenly see Farhan Saab in a, in a very, very sort of imposing, <laughs> I don't even, I don't describe it in this situation. Hai. But uh, Farhan Saab, I won't do you, you know, you're in the middle of something, but thank you for joining us. Thank you so much. I'm just going to, very quickly, I'm just going to uh, take a few minutes to share with you now what, what, is, what is in store in, in Ramzan, a little bit about our Ramzan campaign and the Ramzan fundraising effort globally. Uh, we are working together across countries more than ever before. And, and uh, let me share with you a few of the images um, uh, from... from um, from our campaign. So I'm sure you have seen um, this girl. Her name is Meer Dadi. Uh, she, she lives uh, in a small village called Gujo, um, clear, close to Thatta. And um, when the TCF principal came to her community to look for children who were out of school, um, this one, this little girl caught her eye. Um, she and her little sister uh, were the two siblings out of school because the elder ones had missed the bus and they were too old for school. Um, but uh, when the principal spoke to the grandmother, who was the matron of the of the family, me that his grandmother was really not too keen on the idea of education back then. And um, these, you know, these chilies that the family picks uh, from the farm. Uh, were a very regular and easy and an and important contributor to the family's wherewithal, right? So she was afraid also of what would happen if all these kids uh, stepped away from, from this uh, core input into the household sort of revenue. Um, but, the, but the principle prevailed and another thing prevailed, a very, very tiny girl, her, she herself, she didn't know what um, the schooling was all about, but our, our uh, team members who went to meet the family say that the grandmother still remembers how much me, Dadi herself, pleaded with her uh, to be sent to school because she had a sense that, you know, and then she promised the family that, you know, her picking the chilies in, in the fields would not stop, nothing else would be uh, impacted, and that uh, they please, she please be sent to uh, to school um i i often i mean since the, in the month or two that we've been preparing this campaign i've been looking at this picture uh the lines on everyone's hands and faces show the hard life that they lead they have led and still lead but um but i but uh, and, and you know me that is part of a group of kids who walks to school and yeah, the school is still four kilometers one way um, and the principal talks about this little group of children from the village who come together every morning to walk together because four kilometers is a long distance to walk alone. Um, and and it's, it's still, um, you know, it's still a tough life. But, um, but my team who came back after the photo shoot and the, and the shoot of the ad says that she never stopped smiling. She never had to be told to pose for the camera. Um, we really, really believe in the dreams of these children. And I want to quickly um, share with you um, the amazing video 
that uh, the team has itself has has um, has um, you know uh, recorded. Um, we were talking about this the other day, and uh, uh, for most of the other charities out there, there are these star producers and and uh, you know creative houses which are making the the videos. But for us, uh, our own marketing team was the one. Um, driving this so uh, bear with me as i share with you and um, the, the our campaign video neend se jagna mushkil to hota hai magar waqt kisi ka intezar nahi karta ek behtar kal humse mangta hai mehnat mushkilon se na haarne ka hausla aur ha अच्छे दिनों के खाब खुशियों के खाब आगे बढ़ने के खाब खाब तो सभी देखते हैं मगर पूरे वही होते हैं जो जागते आंखें देखें टी सी एफ मयारी तालीम के जरिए ऐसे लाखों बच्चों को एक बेहतर कल के लिए तैयार कर रहा है और उन्हें अपने ख्वाबों को सच करना सिखा रहा है आइए इस रमजान अपनी जक़ात से इन ख्वाबों को सच बनाने में टीसीएफ की मदद कीजिए सो सो या द क्रिएटिव पार्ट ऑफ़ द कैंपेन आई आल्सो वांट टू शेयर विद यू व्हाट वी आर डूइंग इन टर्म्स ऑफ रनिंग दिस फंड रेजिंग एफर्ट वेरी क्विकली व्हाट आर द एलिमेंट्स ऑफ ऑफ दिस कैंपेन एंड रियली what it comes down to is are these elements um you know all of us we've been talking about uh, digital for a while and this year more than ever before we are investing not only money more money than ever we have ever invested in digital and the various elements of digital digital you name it we are we are really sort of uh, increasing our capability there but also we are um, partnering with one of the best agencies a digital media and marketing agencies in the world uh this is a global agency it's not an agency that we hired in pakistan and uh we're really trying to see if we can do justice uh to the narrative that the global narrative that we are trying to build and the one that and the narrative that you are all um supporting through your fundraising efforts uh supporting this digital effort there is a lot of direct mail in pakistan in the us in canada and everywhere else we we are fundraising there is telecalling uh, there's a very small team in pakistan but i know that Uh, a fantastic volunteer effort which was actually piloted in 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 the us uh, a while ago is 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 gaining steam and and growing um we will be advertising on tv for on pakistani channels beamed to the united states canada uk and uae and not pakistan because pakistan it just costs too much to advertise on tv in pakistan uh, these days during ramzan but we are on tv in all of your key markets and um, some uh, print advertising will continue in pakistan of course we will be on tv and other media in terms of unpaid uh, promotional opportunities and one new exciting thing that we are doing for the first time is all of us will be able to uh, fundraise digitally uh, through peer to peer fundraising on a single global platform we have developed this platform uh, in order to allow uh, fundraisers uh, in the tcf family to create campaigns and uh, involve their families and friends from all over the world uh, when anyone in the us canada uk uh, donates uh, they will be able to have a local tax credit for their donation and still be able to participate in a global peer to peer fundraising campaign for tcf so this is a really exciting new step but underlying all of this we deeply deeply understand that the power of tcf fundraising community rests on the tcf family itself its volunteers i get to represent tcf in a lot of global forums and when they learn about how much we uh, are able to generate for education and how few people there are in, who are employed to ask for money um they literally just shake their heads and i am uh, left very proud of the community tcf and its founders and all its elders have built over the years so i'll stop the slides for now and i want to go to mushtaq saab um to to ask for his uh, views today how does he feel as we step into ramzan 
and and um, try to try to make the same magic happen. Assalamualaikum, everybody. Uh, first of all, I take offense, Zia. You stop this auntie business. You know, Nilufar auntie is not anybody's auntie, and I would like you to please retract that in the future. Nilufar, see, I told you I would support you, and I'm so happy. I'm I so love happy. being called auntie by all of them. Just because they don't call you Nana doesn't mean you disturb them. <laughs> no, no. So can I also call you auntie then? Yes, anytime. <laughs> Okay, good. Okay. It's, first of all, it's good to see so many young and intelligent women. You know, there are more women on this uh, call than, uh, than men. So, so three cheers for you all. And uh, I don't think that I need to guide you. I didn't need to educate you on how to raise money. But you all have proven beyond a shadow of doubt that what, what is the power of, uh, alhamdulillah, power of education and power of the children and the girls and boys of Pakistan, you know, really, yeah. really are uh, very fortunate, very fortunate that we have such a great a group of volunteers, group, group of workers who are giving their time, their energies, their resources and sacrificing. Like I said, I cannot, cannot and should not give you a sermon on how to go about this Ramzan or in future. So we are, we are, we are sure that Allah Ta'ala uh, will, will sort of uh, give us that kind of uh, blessing. Every, like every year we have been, mashallah, year, year uh, coming up with miracles and miracles are not stopping. So keep at it and go on, uh, go on and uh, challenge yourself and challenge the donors and get more money out of them. So God bless you and thank you. Thank you, Mushtaq Sahib. Um, since we're doing well on time, I wanted to see if I could ask for Ranbai to, to jump in. Um, we do want to make this a North American affair. Uh, so very quickly, Ranbai, if you could if you could speak to what Canada is doing uh, very quickly and, 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 and how they see Ramzan coming up. You're still on mute. Assalamu alaikum everyone. Uh, I didn't get time to change. I just came back uh, completing my Umrah. And uh, all I wanted to say was, uh, I've been here many, many times before, but what I do uh, outside of my personal life has never been part of my prayer. And uh, Alhamdulillah, uh, this time, I think most of my time in my prayers uh, included everybody uh, who is part of TCF. Uh, Alhamdulillah, it was uh, uh, just a different kind of prayer this time. Uh, specifically talking about uh, uh, Canada, uh, we have just added uh, uh, a director of development uh, to our team. She's on the call. Azainab and uh, uh, Mushtaq Bhai talked about, you know, uh, young, uh, powerful women. We've added one in Canada. And inshallah, we hope to do uh, better than last year and better than any year uh, that we've been uh, at it uh, in the past. Uh, inshallah, uh, various activities uh, that are happening in the U.S. and then some of them are in coordination as well with uh, Salman and with uh, Arif and his team. Uh, we we expect to be uh, uh, starting uh, again our uh, literacy challenge this year in the next few days, and uh, hope to uh, to inspire more people to add more to the caravan that is already uh, uh, formed and growing. And uh, I don't want to get into the details, but uh, we are excited, we are committed, and inshallah, we will, we will get to an even better place uh, than we have been before. Thank you, Zia. Thank you so much, Farhan Bhai. Um, Canada has crossed 3 million and, and uh, in, the, in, in an annual fundraising, and, and um, ever since Farhan Sahib has come into the the CEO uh, role, it's, it's uh, literally, I see this energy, um, you know, coming, coming across. Uh, I've met him for lunch a few days ago in London. He has been all over the place. I can tell you he travels a lot. And, um, you know, this, this group of um, team members in London who are part of the TCF UK team, 
uh, it took about uh, three minutes for Farhan Saab to hold court. And uh, soon they were all listening to how wonderful Canada is doing. And, and they'd forgotten everything they knew about TCF UK itself. So uh, inshallah, inshallah, you know, uh, your prayers, uh, Farhan Bhai, will be answered. Um, I am supposed to go to uh, Ati Saab now. Uh, and, and, and I'm conscious that we do have time. So Ati Saab, do, uh, I will ask you actually twice. Uh, to, to first say a few words and then after the Q&A, which we will inshallah uh, be able to have, I'd also ask you to say a few parting words uh, to, to all of us. So um, the first part is just what would you like to you know, share with us about, about this, this unique effort? You're still on mute. <laughs> I beg your pardon. Assalamu alaikum, everybody. Bismillah, thank you, uh, wonderful people that I see on the screen. They don't fit on one screen. I have to toggle uh, between two screens of small photographs to see this wonderful uh, lot of uh, committed uh, people. Um, I will just touch on one or two very brief points before Zia, you can start your Q&A. One is uh, a, a point raised by Nilofar was that we were able to pay salaries. I cannot even begin to tell you what a wonderful effect this has had on the entire TCF teacher and principal and employee fraternity. They uh, saw people and their own family uh, lose incomes, but uh, TCF stood with them. And I think uh, this has made them even more creative and even more, uh, more committed. And uh, the, the power of uh, your volunteer spirit uh, is, is as important as the power of education. It is the, the big drive that comes from all of you uh, that as Farhan has very rightly said, they, you know, this becomes part of our life and part of our prayer set, Alhamdulillah, that we say, you know, Godspeed and good luck to all, all the children and all the wonderful staff and management who do this job. Uh, the rest, uh, I will leave to uh, Zaya after the question and answer. Zaya. Gee, thank you, Risa. Um, I'll just open this up now. <clears throat> uh, I know that there is a question already in the chat box. So uh, let me start with that about the video. Uh, absolutely, the video is for you. It will be adapted to each country its own donation information, its own call to action, mm -hmm. and in terms of language as well. Your local country um, office uh, in, in TCF USA's case, Salman and his team, and, uh, and in uh, um, Canada's case, um, Farhan Bhai and, and Zainab and the team, and we'll, we'll be getting these to you if they, already, if they haven't already done so. So absolutely, those have been created for you. Um, I'm looking at the chat box again, and it says, can TCF take Fitra donation and Qurbani? We haven't done so, Imran Saab, so far. Um, it is, uh, Qurbani is a very, very different operation. Uh, we have, we don't want to take on something which we uh, lack the capacity to, to deliver in its uh, true spirit and, 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 and meet the true expectations. Um, so we haven't done so yet. Um, let's see if there's, um, you know, a space to do that in the future. Um, and, and of course, I think, you know, over time, um, you know, I don't, I don't want to make uh, a religious kind of uh, answer to the Fitra question, but I know that all of us sometimes do, um, uh, you know, make the intention and use our donation um, uh, to, to, to fulfill that obligation as well. Please forgive me if, if uh, I, I uh, cross any um, religious sort of uh, edicts in, the, in saying so, but uh, it, it uh, does depend so much on your intention. Um, any questions and any other questions that I can take now, please unmute yourself and go ahead and ask, or, or perhaps raise your hand uh, if I, and I can come to you. Uh, I will go to the chat again while you guys consider your questions. What is the policy for TCF for, ch in ch for children in Pakistan who unfortunately are not fully documented? Their parents, for some reason or other, never felt the need to have birth certificates for them. Do we turn them away or we have, we have, uh, a, way if, have a way of accommodating such children? 
I will ask uh, Asasab to add to my answer, but uh, while he thinks about it, I can tell you that I have met many children uh, in my school visits who are um, of Bengali descent, who are uh, Afghanis, and they do not have um, the requisite documents. I have rarely seen anybody being turned away from a TCS school if we have space and they are deserving. Uh, Asasab, would you like to add to that answer? I don't have anything more to add to it. I think uh, we don't turn away any kids at all. Um, so, documentation having said that, we have a documentation better than any to Koshish Karehin. And inshallah, when we meet, um, I'll be telling you about this amazing project that we recently started, Taluk Kedamse. Thank you. Uh, do raise your hands or uh, drop your questions in the chat box if you have any. This is a great time. You have all the founders and management online. Um, you know, while you consider that, uh, I was I was talk, thinking of of um, uh, what uh, you know Atit Saab just said about the volunteers of TCF and and the family that we've built. Um, a few a few. Uh, months ago, in fact, almost a year ago, we were deep in the conversation on uh, developing TCS new values and are trying to articulate that. And, and Asad Saab, every time he would be in that session, uh, would we say, you know, these words can come and go, but the, the central word, which must, we must find a way of communicating that is that we are a family. And, and that, that um, was brought home very recently when, one of our uh, staff members, um, he was an Agahi um, you know, team member. He used to be uh, responsible for monitoring the Agahi centers in the various small communities near Lahore, uh, in fact, all over Punjab. And he met a very unfortunate accident and, and uh, passed away in that accident. No, 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 no. This is a very, very recent occurrence. And... Um, you know, um, Amna, uh, who, who runs the Agahi uh, and, and program and, and the community development unit, um, I, I saw her that morning uh, completely, you know, bereft as one would when you lose a family member. Um, the team had been awake all night trying to get the injured, um, the, another injured colleague to a hospital and trying to get the body back home. I'm sorry to dampen the spirit, but I want to show uh, to share with you uh, what the unit did, and you know, they made heaven and earth meet that night to uh, to to make things happen near Bahawal Nagar and, and Port Abbas, which is you know, hours away from Lahore. And and Amna just you know went uh, two days ago to meet their family, um, you know, in that very remote location, just to be able to tell them that this entire nineteen thousand strong uh, community and and many other thousands of volunteers all over the world are with them. Uh, it is very rare that I've never been in, a, in a, an organization actually which, which feels that way about its members, whether they're employees or volunteers. And, and it really you know, goes to the spirit of what we have here. Um, I'll quickly go to Zainab who has her hands up. Thank you, Zainab. Welcome, by the way. Thank you so much. Thank you. Um, Salam alaikum to everyone. My name is Zainab Malik. Um, just like Uncle Rahan, Zia, hey, everyone's kind of been mentioning. Um, I did recently join TCF Canada and it has been a roller coaster. It's been a whirlwind for the past two months, but Alhamdulillah, really, really good stuff. I've not only been supported by Rahan Uncle um, and Sajid Bhai and a few other members on the team in Canada, but it's been global. So thank you to everyone who has been there. Uh, Nasrullah, Salman Bhai, Abdullah Bhai, everyone. So thank you so much. Um, I just wanted to say it to reiterate what you just said, Zia, it's amazing how everyone has come together in TCF and everyone truly is a family. Everyone's so supportive and the work that we do, alhamdulillah, is just absolutely impeccable. So I'm very honored to be in this call in front of, you know, uh, Asad Saab, uh, Mushtaq Pai, and Nila Faranti, that seems like an amazing human being that I need to meet soon, inshallah. Um, but 
I'm really looking forward to Ramzan and TLC as well. It's uh, one of the biggest and the first project that I'm going to be working on. So it'll be really, really nice to, you know, join in, um, run in into Ramzan and see how everything is working. But uh, I just want to say salam and it's really nice to meet all of you. And inshallah, I'll meet most of you in Houston as well. And um, yeah, I'm just really looking forward to continuing on for this year and inshallah future years as well. Can I say Brilliant. something? Yes, Zainab, please. I am also looking forward to meeting a lot of these people that I've just seen on the screen and not met. So you <laughs> and I will, will get to know them personally when we meet. Inshallah, I'm coming. <laughs> inshallah. Um, inshallah. I have dragged my way through to this event. I shall be reaching there. Inshallah. <laughs> If somebody doesn't tell me to get lost. <laughs> I'll be with you, Nilo Ferranti. It's all good. Thank you. Thank you. Nilo Ferranti, the only, the only person who, who thwarted your previous visits is no longer in power. She has sworn. I agree. I don't want to say that. I'll tell them there when I reach. She, she has sworn <laughs> and worked very hard. <laughs> <laughs> okay, super. Um, we have a question on uh, on uh, the chat box. Uh, actually, it's a more of a comment. Faiza is is feeling nostalgic and saying, "Hang on, how come the impact numbers don't include the alumni impact numbers?" Not sure if it's intentional, um, but it's a recurring question. Faiza, the 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 slide had fifty three thousand alumni so uh, please uh, don't let this uh, don't don't miss it um, there are lots of other impact numbers obviously uh, surrounding our fantastic alumni the fact that most of them go on for higher education the fact that most of them are earning now or still studying 86 percent of them are either earning or still studying if they're above the age of 22 so we just couldn't fit more of those numbers but the 53,000 kids who have graduated and from grade 10 in TCF is very much a part of the narrative on, on alumni. Let me know if I have understood the question uh, incorrectly. Uh, yeah, it's more about the journey uh, that they get on with later as they graduate. So more about how many continue education, um, how many actually move forward with the higher education and you know things like skill development, uh, it's a recurring question. Um, it's, um, you know, just to over understand the overall impact. I think it just makes more sense if we give a couple of basic numbers um, other than, you know, what we've already included. So that's just a thought. Sure. No, I, I take your point. Um, and let's let's think about it. Uh, it's always a challenge, Faiza, to to focus on one thing when TCF is actually becoming more of a platform uh, for so many fantastic programs rather than just um, the, the formal schooling um, core program itself. And so to give, um, you know, um, to do justice to all of the impact is always hard, but I totally take your point. I think this is the biggest um, outcome that we have been able to produce. So, so definitely deserves more um, bandwidth. I'll go to Salman now as his hands up. Hand up. <laughs> Thank you, Zia. Um, I just said 60 seconds. I had to talk to you about two things. Number one, the 71 participants that are here. Thank you very much for coming here. It's a Sunday morning, and we are all volunteers. So, uh, everybody has planned. Houston has a picnic today. There's another run. Hai. There are activities happening right now uh, in the chapters. और कुछ लोग गाड़ियों से अटेंड कर रहे हैं सो बहुत शुक्रिया आपका एहसान साहब जस्ट वांटेड टू शेयर के हमने 19 मिलियन का नफ्सियाती हदफ पार कर लिया हमने अल्हम्दुलिल्लाह 20.4 पे एंड किया है 2021 सो सो जी हमने जो स्टॉक्स को डोनेशन के जब डाल के हमने देखा जब बेचे वो स्टॉक के लोगों ने स्टॉक्स डोनेट किए थे 20.4 पे टीसीएफ यूएसए ने एंड किया है मैंने जो नंबर दिया था वो इसलिए था कि नजर ना लगे दो और चीजें बिफोर आई हैंड इट बैक टू जिया नंबर वन के मेरे मुझे ये ऑनर है कि मैंने टीसी पाकिस्तान के लोगों के साथ और बच्चों के साथ भी बहुत वक्त गुजारने का मौका मिला है और अब मैं टीसी यूएसए के लोगों के साथ वक्त गुजार रहा हूँ 
जब हम पाकिस्तान में वॉन्टरिंग करते थे तो अक्सर यू नो जब थोड़े बहुत डाउन होते थे या कुछ होता था तो कोई ना कोई तरीके कार से आप जरूर एक स्कूल के चक्कर लग जाता था चाहे वो करियर काउंसलिंग थी चाहे वो रहबर था चाहे वो कभी कभी कोई क्लोजिंग सेरेमनी में आप इन्वाइट हो जाते थे लेकिन ये जो हमारे सत्तर टी सी एफ जो अब यहाँ जो हमारे वॉल्टियर्स हैं इट्स इवन मोर डिफिकल्ट आप चंद हजार मील दूर हैं फ्रॉम द एक्शन और वहां से ये पैशन और दिखाना सो इट्स डेफिनेटली वेरी डिफिकल्ट डिफरेंट प्ले जब यहाँ अलहमदुल्ला ये एनर्जी दिखा रहे होते हैं और कर रहे होते हैं सो इट्स टीम एज वेल लास्ट बिफोर आई हैंड इट बैक अलहमदुल्ला जनवरी और फेबरी भी इस डायनामिक टीम ने बहुत अच्छा शुरू किया हम तकरीबन कोई ढाई से तीन गुना ज्यादा पे बैठे हुए हैं देन 2021 के जनवरी और फेबरी पे uh, 2022 के जनवरी और फेबरी के नंबर पे सो so, अलहमदुल्ला हमारी टीम जो है वो रमजान पे तो करेगी करेगी बट इवन द जनवरी एंड फेबरी अल्लाह इनको इसका अजर देगा दिस डायनामिक टीम वी हैव क्रॉस 2.2 मिलियन डॉलर्स इन द फर्स्ट टू मंथ हमारा ईयर कैलेंडर ईयर होता है इन द फर्स्ट टू मंथ फर्स्ट टू मंथ्स ऑफ डोनेशन सो विद दैट आई जस्ट हैंड इट बैक टू जिया बट जस्ट वांटेड टू शेयर द द ग्रेट वॉलंटियर्स दैट आर देयर इन दिस कॉल थैंक यू सो मच सलमान दैट इज अमेजिंग टू हियर um you know um Uh, I, again i'm not going i'm not going to jinx it so <laughs> let's leave it there but thank you so much yeah. i totally agree with you this is uh, sort of sort of path breaking uh, i want to get in as many questions as i can so the next one is from shaka saab how government schools are, how are government schools doing can you share what improvements are being made uh, very close to my heart let me quickly give you an update uh, government schools are thriving um, with the help uh, you know there there are three layers of how we see a school improvement journey one is infrastructure then is operations and then is the academic uh, outcomes and in terms of infrastructure alone uh, we were challenged by the um, the uk aid uh, agency the the government of of the uk whether we could put together 700 rooms in in i think it was 4 months um and we went from absolutely nothing on the ground to fully constructed high quality uh 700 rooms including 100 bathrooms across um our adopted government schools uh thanks to a 1 billion rupee almost a 4 million pound uh grant that we received from uk aid so it wasn't just that they felt we were as credible or more credible than the punjab government which was all the other co grantee it was that we they were giving our examples to the punjab government of how quickly and in what great quality Uh, rooms could be built so that was the infrastructure part we still trying to complete that journey but um, we've done a huge um, addition to that thanks to this grant and today the kids in the government schools are protected from the elements and and we can move to operational stability and academic outcomes we are training teachers as we speak we are rolling out the principal quality index which is uh, the most powerful tool within uh, flagship schools to improve principal quality and in turn the the school quality so a lot of the what we have learned over the years in flagship school programmatically those things are now being rolled out in government schools and um, of course outcomes are improving we are consciously and and consistently benchmarking that against um, the 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 ecosystem uh, so i'll i'll leave it at that but happy to answer more in more detail when we meet in may um i know that there is another question yes this is the second time this question has been asked me this week uh, a donor in the uk asked me this question as well what kind of contribution is coming from successful alumni any record of this uh you know this was on my things to do when i returned from this trip that i just took uh we need to start tracking this but i know that uh, whenever we send out a volunteer call uh, a lot of the folks who uh who uh come back to us as as volunteers are not obviously tcf uh, alumni but we are steadily seeing a growing kind of number come through and and sometimes it's a big reveal sometimes you they come through and and after a half an hour of a meeting somebody says oh by the way you don't know but i'm working in mers or i'm i'm a programmer in systems limited but i'm i'm also a tcf graduate i have <laughs> tcf graduates now working in my team uh they are one of my most dependable team members um so some of you may be receiving school reports from someone who has actually been uh, in a tcf school uh we will track this if the number is not going to be massive in terms of dollars 
we will track both how many alumni are donating and as and how much are donating but if you donating but if you think of it in terms of a timeline uh, the earliest cohorts are now in a position where they are in maybe their third or fourth year of their professional sort of journey so even if you think back on your third or fourth year of your professional journey it takes a little while to establish yourself and for these kids it's the time when they're buying a little bit of assets in their homes maybe putting in an ac maybe you know investing in their in in having their fathers retire so this is that time of the journey for them for them but we will definitely be tracking this atish sahab has a hand his hands up so i'll pause is there uh, on the issue of alumni uh, just this point that it will probably be the next generation after the current generation of alumni who will really come forward in in a big way inshallah and secondly uh, secondly uh, something fantastic happened during covid that we actually used our alumni used is perhaps uh, in a positive sense were able they were able to make a huge contribution in getting uh, rations and food stuff delivered to the needy in their own communities and thousands of tcf alumni got involved and reported back and as a result the program was a huge success alhamdulillah secondly the the good thing that the alumni department has done is that they've got out of the 53000 who graduated they've got they are now in touch with almost 40000 that's a huge database and inshallah something will very positive will come of it thank you thank you atish sahab um i have a couple of questions i have a few minutes so a couple of questions about um more operational stuff but really critical stuff in the us i'm going to come to you salman and and or fakia or or mavish if you want to take that but one is about corporate matching shajil wants to know what we're doing to maximize corporate matching uh and the message needs to be reiterated and the second is from mahin who's saying you know austin needs uh support on instagram what are we going to do on that um so why don't you take both of those um whichever one of the us um team okay. wants to okay fakia do you want to take the corporate matching one or do you want me to do it sure um i can and if i miss anything let me know uh good question um so we have a very strong program for corporate matching um i'll go over the what's working for us and then i'll also go over what we need help with um so the good news is our corporate matching funding has gone up 40% over the past 2 years and uh, we have purchased a service from e-tapestry which is our CRM um and we were able to get about 2000 uh employer information uh, employer information for about 2000 donors now we have a much larger um uh, you know number of donors in our system and that's what we're struggling with we need information on the employers for our donors and we have tried a few things everyone today is our second day i'm oh, sorry so we're trying a few things you know during events we uh now that we've started events we want to capture the employer information from our guests so we can keep adding that information in our system and um i request um everyone here uh you know if you're part of the chapter team to please inform the donors about our corporate matching program now the way it works is um we have a link on our website and anybody could go and this is on our donate page uh you can go and see if your um employer matches a tcf and it's a really nice tool it gives you instructions on how to go about uh submitting your application and your receipt to your company to get your donation matched and you can always um you know have the donors either contact me or gul and we can uh you know in, uh, sort of guide the donor on how to get their donations matched so the program is going well um but you know we have very limited information that's what we're struggling with so as much information as we get on the employers for our donors um you know we'll do we can do a better job thanks so much fakia um on any quick notes on the instagram please yeah Amavish, um, would you like yeah, to take that? I can take that. Assalamu alaikum, everyone. Um, so, uh, just to answer uh, that question, I'm I was just reading through it. Um, in terms of postings and sharing our organic content on Instagram, we have a national page, and we 
post on it very regularly. Anything that goes on Facebook where we have, you see bulk of the activity, the same content also goes on Instagram on our national page. In order to develop the local Austin area page, we will probably ask for help from you as well to identify, share page information, invite members to actually follow the page so that we can develop it and we can definitely help in terms of sharing content on that page regularly. So there'll be, uh, I think we'll probably have to play a tag team with the chapter itself to try to grow the number of followers on Austin Instagram page. Um, the other uh, way I would also want to um, answer this question is that this year we have a new agency and we would be asking them to help us uh, kind of grow our engagement on our social me media platforms as well. So whatever we are doing uh, so far, hopefully we'll have more support from an agency that's an expert in this area to actually make it better. So, um, you know, be in touch with us, uh, Maheen and uh, uh, through Sahar, I'll find out exactly what you guys are looking for. But hopefully, inshallah, this year we should be in a better position to help you guys from many different aspects of increasing social media followership. Thank you so much, Mavish. Uh, I think this we run out of time, but I do have one more question, and I just want to be cheeky and take it. And I'd like to ask Asasab, who has a lot more experience on this uh, than I do. A question in the recent Calgary Gala was how do we manage pressure from local influentials for admission for their recommended children when we are already at max strength for the area school? Um, this could just be uh, equally valid for any pressure from local influentials. So Asasab, you want to jump in on how uh, we've done that? In the honestly, past? With the, <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Okay, there's pressure जो भी बच्चा हो उसको हम दें चाहे वो डेरे का बच्चा हो या वो किसी का भी बच्चा हो लेकिन ऐसा नहीं कभी भी नहीं ऐसा हुआ कि हमने किसी गरीब बच्चे को छोड़ा हो और उसके बजाय किसी ऐसे बच्चे को ले लिया जो ज्यादा इंटेंशनल सो आई डोंट थिंक दिस इज रियली अबाउट शुगर ऐसा कोई mute <laughs> um i think one one angle of this is generally pressure as well and and i've seen an incredibly steely uh response from tcf if they're being pushed around by a local influential on let's say hiring somebody they want us to hire or doing something else and i've um, seen us play real sort of hardball with them um, even walk away from a school when we were being really pressurized to hire people we didn't want to hire. Uh, can I just add? Please do. Please do. senior minister me phone interview लेकिन होता यही है कि वो इंटरव्यू में अक्सर वो लोग इस काबिल नहीं होते एंड अनफॉर्चूनेटली दैट लेडी वाज बीइंग रिप्रेजेंटेड कुन मेक इट इन द इंटरव्यू सो अल्टीमेटली शी वाजंट सिलेक्टेड एंड इट वाज जस्ट लाइक रूटीन मतलब ना जिस रीगल मैनेजर को मैंने कहा था उसने मुड़ के मुझे सच्ची बात है कि ये बताना मुनासिब नहीं समझा कि उसने उसको रिजेक्ट कर दिया और मुझे इस सेंस में उसकी बड़ी खुशी हुई कि मतलब इट्स टेकन एज अ नॉर्मल स्टैंडर्ड थिंग के ठीक है हम उतनी कर्टसी जरूर दिखाएंगे कि इंटरव्यू वगैरह कर लेंगे लेकिन जहां पे मेरिट का सवाल है इंशाल्लाह ताला उस पे कोई कॉम्प्रोमाइज नहीं करेंगे अल्हम्दुलिल्लाह ओके सुपर सो वी आर एट टाइम बिफोर आई आस्क द फाउंडर्स टू क्लोज आई बिलीव वी हैव अ क्विक पोल ऑल राइट आई don't know how to Wait, I lost that question where it just disappeared. How do I access the poll? I have no idea. I, I found it. I found it. <laughs> Click on the poll if you don't see it anymore. <laughs> this technology is clearly leaving me behind. <laughs> the coffee and anima saw again. Thank you, everyone. Uh, I know that there are more responses out there, but I think we understand the general feeling of the room. 
could I ask the founders, uh, any and all of them, please, to help me close this wonderful conversation? Thank you. It, it's, it's, yes, Mushtaq, you were saying? You, well, the price is a factor, right? Yeah. Some people might. I didn't say, uh, I didn't say anything. Chairman Sahib, you lead the founders. Bless you. Uh, uh, for, okay, I, I'll start quickly with this pressure thing, and I'm uh, extremely happy to report, and I've said this to some uh, um, supporters in Dubai as well, that uh, starting from myself and Mushtaq and Ehsan and uh, our dear brother Arshad Abdullah passed away and Rashid who passed away, we've never actually till today in these 27 years ever sent uh, a candidate for appointment to TCF, by the grace of God, and we may actually pass away uh, in this state of mind, because the the merit that we meritocracy that we believe in has to be carried through in letter and spirit, and it starts from us. So uh, very pleased uh, to say this, and a request for all of you uh, to pray that we should all remain like this forever, inshallah. Uh, I'd like to uh, everybody to recognize that the management of TCF is uh, getting more and more to be a bigger and bigger challenge. And uh, it is people who come here only for a job, they're not satisfied. So you have to have a quote unquote, a missionary zeal uh, driving you, egging you on to make a difference. And when that is combined with the managerial excellence or managerial desire or a good managerial push, uh, by the grace of God, uh, good results uh, come your way. This is the way a good management is supposed to perform. We are, we are uh, very honored to be hosting all of you and for you to be hosting us will be a, a great pleasure for us when we get there. Uh, this, uh, the purity with which TCF operates, I think possibly is really the big engine, the sincerity and the purity. And it's all pushing in the same direction. Uh, unlike, unfortunately, some, uh, the very basic idea of democracy is one pushes, the other pulls. But here everybody pushes and push in the same direction. And a great support from each other is, is how we get our strength, you know the way Mushtaq and Hassan uh, will support and hold and encourage is really what uh, I think the 27 years of TCF has uh, all been about. Um, it, I spoke about the, how the jobs, how we uh, managed to take the teachers forward. This is really, this is really it. Uh, this is what, what keeps us going. And I'd like to thank all of you for, for being here and uh, joining the family and pushing. And with the seniors like myself and Hassan and Mushtaq and some others on the screen, uh, by the grace of God, I think satisfied seniors. Abdullah Saab is right in front of me. Uh, he's my senior. So uh, the two families go back a long way. The way he has supported us juniors uh, talks of how TCF has gone where it's gone. It's, it's how the, the Buzurgan have, have helped us and pushed us along, uh, our seniors, our elders. And we hope we can do something, uh, a minuscule part of that for all of you. I see a lot of very fresh young uh, faces here and <laughs> very confident, inshallah, with God's grace, with the purity of intent and sincerity that you will be able to take TCF to places which we only dreamt of. God bless you all. Thank you so much, uh, Um I have nothing to add to that. We are uh, always so grateful um, for the spirit of this group. I'll share the results of the poll as well. I think oh, everybody so is feeling, <laughs> alhamdulillah, excited. Um, about about this Ramzan and, and about being part of this fantastic family. Uh, thank you, everyone. Uh, I've taken eight more minutes than I should have, but uh, thank you and, and um, may God be with us. Yeah, one thing, month. I see the results of the poll. 
Everybody is excited, 100%. <laughs> <about> her <laughs> <son>. <laughs> I don't think so many Pakistanis have ag- ever agreed on anything. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, let's let's quit while we're ahead. <laughs> yes, yes. Good, thank good. you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Okay. Very much. Alaikum, everybody. Allah. Okay, man. Everybody. Allah.